Hey my people, so today I have some things here that I got um, the other day at Walmart. They're, they're not really wants, they're, they're necessities really, well, what I consider to be necessities. Um, so first off, I've never used this before, but like I said in the last video, I've been breaking out really bad around my chin and mouth area. and. I haven't broken out like that since I was like a teenager and it's really bothering me but I'm um, trying to get a handle on it and I'm using Cetaphil and it's for normal to oily skin and I actually really like the smell of it it smells I don't know it has a different kind of smell but I really like it and you get a bunch like look how big that bottle is just you know you're just using it on your face so got that then I got this which is kind of hard for me to talk about but you know we're all women here and men here and we're all human and we all get stretch marks and I got Palmer's cocoa butter formula tummy butter for stretch marks well what I'm really using this on um, since I started my medicines some of my scars and stretch marks have turned back red again and I do not know why I don't understand it but on my arms I have it I'm not gonna show y'all cuz it's just <sighs> but um this test was really good to me um, the cocoa butter the the Palmer's cocoa butter used to stink but now it smells really good and this is a really thick I mean really thick formula and I'm gonna put it on day and night day and night day and night and see if anything changes cuz it just it hurts my heart I'm, I'm trying to lose weight and it just hurts my heart to see stretch marks it really does but anywho um, then I take vitamins every day and I always wanted to try these and they like kids usually take this kind but I wanted to it's one of day Vita Craze gummies and it's immunity support and all that good stuff and so far they're really good I really like them <laughs> um I wanted to take the Flintstone ones but they're for children so I got those and then y'all I am in love with this right here yes I kept it in the box I keep everything in the box till I show y'all but this is Garnier fruit tea or fruit tree or whatever, however you say it, and um, it's moisture rescue refreshing gel cream locks in locks locks in moisture for 24 hours and blocks out blocks out dryness and it's oil free and it's made with grape water extract whatever that is and vitamin E. And I like that it says on here this is the actual size of it. Um, so you're seeing on the box the actual size of the product in the box. So that's cool. And it is oil free. Even though, even though you break out and you have excess oils, you need to still moisturize, but you need to moisturize with oil free products. So this to me, this is amazing. This is like a counter product it is it smells wonderful it has a really creamy smooth texture but once you put it on your skin it like seeps into the skin it doesn't sit on top and it just makes you feel so soft I love it I love this Garnier and I would really love to try more of the Garnier um, line but I'm really digging that right now and then we have animals we're constantly cleaning constantly sweeping the floors mopping the floors spraying smell goods because you don't want your house to smell like a dog pan um, oh yeah I didn't tell y'all I have a dog now named Angus I have to show him to y'all sometime um, he is a black mouth cur and he is two months old and probably weighs around 20 pounds <laughs> He's going to be a big dog. He's a big boy. And uh, he makes big messes too. But this is called, this is from Mainstay. This is Walmart Brands. Um, vanilla. It says vanilla, y'all, but it smells like a, it smells like a cupcake. And I love it. And, 
you spray this around and it and it stays and I'm also still using my Scentsy my Scentsy is like amazing for my room okay and that is all of the haul that I got I just got a few things okay now here is my April favorites I don't have that much but I'm not gonna sit here and lie to y'all and say something I like something I didn't um, this is mineral magic um, it's mineralmagiccosmetic.com it's highlight orange it looks like this it's really little it's really little I don't know if y'all can see that but um this was given to me by Megan Sullen Riot and if I can take I love loose pigments I really do however they can get everywhere that's the only thing I hate about them and this has like some kind of duochrome in it you may not be able to see it on camera but I'm gonna swatch it anyways if y'all can see y'all you really can't see it but in person it is really pretty it has like this duochrome it's called highlight orange and you can see some kind of a tinge of orange to it but it's really pretty highlight I love it um, then comes my Essie um, Lux effects nail polish and set in stone and it's these octagonal pieces of glitter all throughout and it reminds me of the 90s I grew up in the 90s and I totally love polish like this and they're coming back out with polish like this and I just love it I'm way into glitter right now and then here is my matte glitter in 3d silver and you can see that in the pot it is like you see that the 3d is so cool love it then another favorite of mine which this is my favorite every month and I could wear this every day of the week I love it and I know that Chanel has one out there like it and there's another fancy brand out there that has another one like this but it's called beetle and it looks like you know how um, a beetle has that weird tingy looking uh, shell to it that changes color in the light it's like a, a duochrome well this is purple but yet it also has green and like a yellow it's just odd and when you turn your fingers in the light it changes colors it's so cool it's like a mood ring then another favorite um, this I could also wear every day of the week this is Max Rubinus paint pot I just love it for like every day um, it's really sheer but it has a really pretty uh, tone to it I love it another one that I'm liking because of this coral craze that's going on yes I am hooked to the coral craze too um, this is Maybelline's color tattoo and it's fierce and tangy and if you thin it out it can look coral but if you want it full on it can look straight up orange like fiery orange love it then another thing that I'm really digging and I think is great for all you girls out there who are just starting out in makeup or who don't have a lot of money to spend on makeup because um, these pots can cost a lot of money for Mac and I have some dupes of these um, in the Revlon brand these are Shad cream shadows is just what they're called but this is the va 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 bloom I have like every one of these and this color right here is the exact dupe of Rubenesque and y'all see how much I've used it and I have I, I do I have like every one of them and I love lip smackers I could eat it okay I licked it I just licked it it is so good what did they put in this crack it is good I love it 
Um, I used to, I used to love these things back in grade school, man. I would, I would put that stuff on. Love it, love it. Then there's another thing that I got. Another couple things I'm gonna talk about. I like this, but I don't like this at the same time, and I'll tell you why. I got the Rockaholic TG Born to Rock Leave-In Detangler and Defrizzer. Wonderful product. I love it. Beautiful product. Beautiful product. Works great. But do you see how it's already this far down and I just got it last month? Well, what I had to do was the um, squirter, it doesn't work. So the nozzle didn't work. So what I had to do is I already was using this Garnet Fruit Trees Triple Nutrition nutrition spray and it only had like that much left in it so what I did was I just concocted my own potion and went on and poured some in there because this nozzle worked so now I use a mixture of this thing for damaged hair with olive avocado and shea and then I use a, with the TG mixed in it works. It didn't blow up, so everything's okay. Now I have two products that I'm going to talk about. I so hate to talk bad about something and put something down, but this is my true feelings on it, and I'm not going to lie to y'all. Um, last month, me and my man were at a salon, and they were having a sale on these fingernail polishes. And I kind of had thought, well... What if these polishes are kind of old or something? But I was going to take a chance on it because they are um, OPI. And the first one is um, Houston. We have a purple. Beautiful colors. And then this one is Ski Till We Drop. Beautiful teal color. And they were on sale for like little or nothing. And I was like, oh my God, I've never had an OPI nail polish. I'm going to try it. Well, this one is really, really thin. When you put it on, you have to do like three coats. And then it's still kind of streakish a little. If you put a thin top coat or if you like put glitter over it, you may not, you may not notice the streakiness, but hey. This is, they're wanting $8.50 for this nail polish. I mean, it should paint your nails for you as much as it costs. Then, with this Ski Till We Drop, it peeled off within days. I mean, I wasn't doing anything spectacular or crazy with my hands. Um, took shower like regular. Um, put on makeup like regular. And then I just noticed it was peeling off. So, and that's a big pet peeve of mine is when it peels off because I will start picking at it. I'm a bad picker when it starts to peel off. So, I don't like polishes that do that because I will peel it off and it ruins your nails when you do that. So, I don't know. Maybe if I add a different type of top coat or... And, and the top coat that I used was Sally Hansen, brand new, so it wasn't anything to do with that. But maybe if I put something else with it, maybe it'll work better. I don't know. But I hate that I paid that kind of money. And I see now this one is broke at the bottom. I'm like, y'all, I just noticed that. Can y'all see that? Y'all might not can. It's broken. It's not broken all the way through, but it's chipped. The glass is chipped. But anyways, this is my haul and my um, April favorites. I hope y'all liked it. And if y'all would like to attach y'all's favorites to mine, feel free. And y'all have a beautiful, lovely day.